Warning. Military software detected. Top secret clearance required. Override detected. Combat software fully customized. Proceed to military intelligence emergency briefing. This situation is G14 classified. Please pay attention and tell nobody. It has recently come to our attention, this beautiful asset, and we need it. We need it in ours. How do we get this asset to become one of our playthings? It is beautiful. Look at it. It has two laser turrets. Where's the turrets? It doesn't matter. They're laser. And look at it. It is the laser Comanche for General Towns. How do we get this beauty? Look at it. That would be a beautiful asset in battle. Yanis, we're sending you in. We know you can do it. Uh, okay. I'm Yanis Shanguar, and this tutorial is going to be about borrowing assets from other mods. Let's be honest. Mods are wonderful. We wish we could do a lot of things that those beautiful authors can do ourselves, but either we don't have the time or we don't know how to exactly make our own units, our own art, or even how to like fully encode things, and that's okay. Um, in fact, the way that I learned a lot of these tutorials that I'm making is by reverse engineering the code, by literally adding assets from some really good mods some bad mods but you know it's like eating a piece of a pie you don't have to eat the whole pie and you know adding it to my personal experience like I'm do not steal this video is not about stealing this is about private use only they go through hard work they spend many hours so much dedication and they deserve all the credit always get permission if you are publicly releasing a mod with somebody else's work always credit this video again is for private and demonstration purposes only <clears throat> so it's real simple start by downloading the mod um, some mods have installers um, and other mods will have just the uh, dot big it will be called many many things in this case we will be uh, going through shockwave which contains the Comanche laser we are looking for open up that file dot big in this case it it is called uh, zero shockwave nine five dot big. Um, I don't know off the top of my head if there's a newer update, but it's been a while. The zero is trying to give it precedence against everything else in your directory. That's why it's named that way. Um, open it up, and so basically, this is the whole mod. This is just how, just like if you were to go to the other .big files in your directory and open them up, it's the same exact idea. Um, since we are copying a unit, we will need to be looking for the unit, its command button, its command set, its weapon set, its armor. If you want to, you can just probably copy the armor that's already in the game. If it's most likely not set that way, it might be set that way. Um, upgrades sometimes and weapon objects. Um, some uh, some actual units and buildings too, if you try to add them, will have multiple um, assets that you'll have to copy over. Um, so in this case, we will locate the... Uh, <clears throat> laser Comanche. We will start by looking for the uh, Laser General. Um, as you can see, it'll be written as data slash INI object, just like it is in your directory. In this case, we've been looking for the Laser General. And you can attempt to go through all this code. Um, if you extract the file and open it up with Notepad, you can go searching through every object. Um, you can use that, that shortcut key 
I showed in another video, if you just put object and colon, it'll go down the road to every object that has a display name. Or, since you may not even know necessarily what general it is, we will try to find it a different way. We will go through the actual command set or the command button. In this case, we know it is a, we will open up the button and we know it is a Comanche. We will look for it in the actual command button. Um, and since we know it's a Comanche, we, uh, let's go down the line for Comanche. There we go. We can see it's the laser command to construct the uh, Comanche vehicle. Um, the object is right here, and its name is Laser American Vehicle Comanche. We just want to copy that over, and then we return back to the laser. Click right there. All the way to the end. I would assume your general is already open and paste it over. Now return back to the to the what you actually just pasted. In a previous tutorial I went over some of the meetings of some of this stuff like the button for this is the cameo these are the upgrade cameos um, since this is a uh, a crossed unit we just want to erase these so they don't um, interfere with anything we know that American training is a thing next we want you to look at model and if you're using notepad plus plus it'll all automatically light them up as you can see in this case these are the art files you will be need needing to copy over in this case it is going to be AV laser Comanche but obviously it's spelled this way all right as you can see this is what it looks like in the in the uh, folder you will need these three files all right so extract those files from the mod um, as you can see these are the three files you're just going to take them and move them into the W3D folder. All right, we have the weapon I and I, and we're going to start with looking. You know, this one is most likely on the other Comanches. Yep, I have seven other matches, so it must be on a, quite a few other units. So we're going to start with the laser Comanche up. Um, what out the non upgrade actually? Um, we're going to get find it and they're most likely all together there. Um, so laser one, laser two, huh? How about that? They're not together. And we're just going to copy them and put them in our weapons. I and I folder. That's the command she one and two. Now I'm going to put in the upgrade. Alright, as you can see, right here, armor has a laser to point defense as the upgrade. Um, we can just change that to uh, something more suitable. In this case, I will be changing it to the normal um, armor upgrade in that sense for uh, air units. All right, we are going to uh, look through more. Um, we do not need some other code, like we do not need this code right here. 
We do not need this code right here either because we do not have these upgrades. This right here, you'll have to uh, find the object creation list. Actually, we're going to skip all that. That's uh, a lost cause. I couldn't really find it that well. Um, we are going to instead go to the Chinook or uh, Kamachi and look for the uh, FEX uh, list die module. And we're just going to copy that over and override that other one. That's essentially what it is. It's when it dies. That's all that's really showing. All right. That's all for this video. Um, stay tuned for part two, which should be probably uploaded right after this one, actually. No, I won't have to wait at all. Feel free to join the Discord if you have any questions. And remember, thank your modders. With them, it wouldn't be anything. Got any questions? Feel free to ask. This is Yanis signing off.